Hey guys, Matt with Murphy Mobile Homes. Today we're going to look at the stagecoach. Four bed, three bath. It's got his master retreat, big tile shower, tons of space. Let's take a look inside. Just starting up a YouTube channel, so thank you guys for watching. I'm sure a lot of you are coming over from TikTok, which has been doing really well lately that as well but here's the stage coach this one's on there we're just going to do a longer look through a little bit more in depth it's a capco out of boaz alabama as soon as you walk in you got this nice foyer area and then you go right into the living room it's got a wood burning fireplace there it's got plumbed up for uh your tv you can fit about 70 inch up there these are full custom so if you want to move the fireplace to the corner or anything like that add some windows in here you can Got plenty of space this is obviously a big sectional couch in here a lot of natural lighting big archway can give you a look around here too back at the front door all right we'll move on into the kitchen area do have options for a sliding glass door or chateau door you can do off the dining room you can do a big deck off to the back and really good for grilling this house is beautiful kitchen custom cabinet colors you got white you got different browns stuff like that countertops choose from this one's got the drawer over doors so all your lower cabinets gonna have drawers over them i personally don't think i have enough utensils to fill them all but I'm sure somebody does. These have 38 inch cabinets. They do offer 42 inch cabinets. Goes up to the ceiling. You can plumb them up for gas. You can do farm sinks. You can do stainless. Do just about anything with these. Big island here. Even the islands are custom in the Capcos. You can have different designs, different colors, different lengths, different widths. These drawers here are kind of. I guess a little rattling from shipping. Those will get fixed once it's set up. Big space for a huge dining room table. This is a little smaller one here, but tons of space. I apologize if the video is a little shaky. This little thing right here crapped out on me. So, of course, first first video on YouTube. It's going to be a little shaky without my gizmo or whatever it's called. Cool thing about this house is four bedroom. All the bedrooms are the same size, so you're not going to have any kids fighting over which one they want, over based on the size at least. It has three bathrooms, and they all have these really large tubs in them too. A lot of times your, your mobile homes will have a little bit smaller ones, and a lot of times you can option for a larger one, and that's what it looks like. It's got pores and sinks. I'll show you how it's the closets. Like I said, the bedrooms are all the same. We'll kind of run through them though, take a look. Good size there, just a little walk-in. Another closet, bedroom here. And some extra parts in here as well. One of the biggest features of this house is what I call the Oh My Pantry. It is enormous. People always, is this a pantry? Yeah, this is a pantry. Look at this thing. It's absolutely huge. You can take shelves out. You can add outlets in here. You can put a freezer in here if you want. Really cool feature of this house. Here's another guest bathroom on this side. It looks just like the other one. Porcelain sink, got your cabinet storage there. Of course, another big tub. And these do, they even have transom this is a uh, one piece fiberglass shower sometimes you'll see they come in multiple pieces capco only does the one piece so you're not gonna have any mold or mildew or leaks or anything like that behind your your showers baths stuff like that bedroom take a look all right look another walk-in closet imagine that this house is loaded with options. Really cool features in it. Utility room here, you can add a locker. You can you know, leave the space for your deep freeze. There's a side door there. 
and it's perfect for a garage or carport. Look at this space in here though. This is where your washer and dryer goes here. Kitchen cabinets that look well look like your kitchen cabinets. Countertops, even has mop sink in here. You got tons of space in here to store stuff. I wish my house had this. You got a water heater, access panel. Uh, question of the day is, do you call it a water heater or a hot water heater? Give you a clue, there's one right answer. There's one common answer. All right, let's move on to everybody's favorite, the master bedroom. This one, it's got cool features on this side. It does not disappoint on the master bedroom side. Walk on over here. There's a big wall right here. Big master bedroom. Big, big, big. You can do accent walls if you want. Change up the colors. Tons of space. Plenty of room for a king size bed. Dressers, all that good stuff. But you also have a master's retreat. A little getaway from the kids. Or you can use that as a nice nursery if you got a newborn. Plenty of space. Now you do have options. You can wall this off and open it up, make your living room larger. You can make it a part of a front porch. You can put arches in there to kind of give some space to the rest of the house. Make it a formal dining room maybe or something like that. Move on into the master bath. Look at this thing. Big tub. 72 inch tub with the decking around it. Nice window. They do have frosted windows there. If you don't feel a little bit shy, you can get the frosted windows. So you got one vanity there. Reach over here, shut this door so you can see behind. And then you got a second vanity here. So his and hers. Or his and his, or hers and hers, or anything in between that you want. Let's get another look at this shower. One thing you always notice about the Tabco tile showers is they put the water or the, the knob, the faucet on the opposite side of the, the shower head. That way, while you wait for your hot water to prime, you're not having to get underneath the cold water, turn it on. It does have plenty of space in here. It's got the rain shower head. Plenty of different colors, tile to choose from. Colors are always free. If you want to upgrade, if you want to do tile instead of carpet, stuff like that, costs a little extra. But here's your water closet. Toilet room, whatever you want to call it. It's optional. You can take these out if you want to rather it open. And then a big closet. Tons of space in here. I if I can get the whole thing in here. Let me try, though. Yeah, space over here. I'm gonna step in. I mean, I, oh, I just bumped my head. I'm glad y'all didn't see that. All right. This beautiful tile flooring in here too. All right. So, I know a lot of people are gonna ask type of pricing and stuff like that. So pricing's a little tough. Depending on where you're at, we're in Bossier City, Louisiana. So if you're around here, if say you live within 150 miles of Bossier City, you'll be looking at about 128, 128,000. That'll include the delivery, your AC, and your vinyl skirting with it. If you're outside of that 150 miles, you need to take, you need to add about $12 a mile, depending on where you're at. So if you're a thousand miles away, it's gonna be twelve thousand extra. Be looking around one forty for this house, which is fine. I will take it to you. It's a beautiful house. We sell a bunch of these. Um, I'm just getting my YouTube channel started, so I know a lot of people are gonna to want to see the Tiger Cat and the Hendrix and the Mayfield and all that. I promise I'm gonna to get to it, but I'm gonna. Have to work in the time to do it. 
I am full time employed here. I do have a lot of active deals, which is always good. But I appreciate everybody watching and uh let me know in the comments what <clears throat> what you'd like to see, what I missed, what you like for me to do differently on these. And I'm gonna try to update, upload probably one or two a week. And I'll probably kind of go through the ones that are on the TikTok page, the Murphy Mobile Homes. If you haven't checked that out yet, make sure you do. And I'd really appreciate a like and a subscribe. And I appreciate it, guys. See y'all next.